Hey you guys. Um, as it is Halloween soon, and I know I didn't film a video, blah 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 blah. Um, I'm gonna do a Halloween Would You Rather. Um, I've gotten this Would You Rather off Tumblr, I haven't read it yet. So, who knows, it might be a bit... If it is, we'll find out. <laughs> Obviously I'm wearing my Halloween um, Nightmare Before Christmas t-shirt. And I've got spoopy nails. These are really hard to do things with, by the way, people. Would you rather walk through a graveyard at midnight or spend the night in a spooky abandoned house? I think I'd walk through a graveyard at midnight um, because if I have to spend the night, I have to spend at least like eight hours there. Whereas if I have to walk through a graveyard at midnight, I have to spend like five minutes. And spooky abandoned houses are spooky and abandoned for a reason. Do you rather dunk for apples or carve a jack-o'-lantern? Um, I am crap at dunking for apples. That's the only Halloween thing we did when I was little because my parents hate Halloween. Um, so I'd much rather carve a jack-o'-lantern because that's fun and creative and you get to do, do pictures or faces or whatever you want. So carve a jack-o'-lantern. Would you rather be allowed to eat as much Halloween candy as you want for a week and then have it the rest taken away from you or only have one a day but never have it taken away for you definitely every day for a week because halloween's only one day a year anyway so if you have it every day for a week you'll feel so sick and you'll want it taken away from you but then you'll still have eaten like so much candy so much candy <laughs> would you rather meet a vampire or meet a werewolf I think I'd rather meet a vampire because if you meet a werewolf um, when they've turned werewolf, so when they've turned wolf, um, then I feel like they have no control over what they do. Whereas when a vampire at night time, um, they still have human inhibitions. Um, so I'd like to meet a werewolf when he's human or if I don't have the option and he has to be a wolf, I'd rather meet a vampire. Um, because at least then you get to talk to them and they don't kill you, like, they kill you but you're undead. Whereas if a werewolf kills you, I'm pretty sure you're dead. I think it's only a bite that, like, one bite means you're alive. I'm not sure. I will have to do my research. <laughs> Leads on to the next, would you rather. Would you rather be a vampire or be a werewolf? 100% be a vampire. Uh, when I was little, I used to have imaginations that, um, you can't see this, but there's a window behind you, um, that there would always be a vampire tapping on the glass asking me to come with him. Yeah, I was a weird kid. Would you rather read a spooky story or see a spooky movie? Um, as much as I love horror films and scary stories, I'm always scared. Um, I read a spooky story when I was in uni and well, none of my housemates were home, so I rang my housemate saying that there was a huge noise outside and I think I'm gonna die. And she laughed at me and um, I didn't die. But then in uni, in my second year, I watched the Chernobyl Diaries and then my whole landing light, when I tried to do it, it flickered when I turned it on and I thought I was gonna die then too. Um, Maybe see a spooky film because I only thought I was going to die and then I went to bed. Whereas when I read the spooky story I thought I was going to die and then stayed awake for like five hours. Would you rather have a costume that's super amazing but really uncomfortable or a costume that's kind of meh but really comfortable? Um, super amazing but uncomfortable. I'm a girl, I wear uncomfortable things all the time. My, having my mum plait my hair was uncomfortable. Wearing this bra is uncomfortable totally an uncomfortable costume. I could put up with that for a couple of hours. Would you rather have a homemade costume or a store-bought costume? Um, completely depends on the quality of the homemade. If I've used my sewing machine and I've made um, a feminine joker costume, which is what I wanted to do with the petticoat and all of that, then I would rather have a homemade costume. But if it's a store-bought costume that is actually like a dress or something like that, um, and it's cheaper than making it myself, then I'd have a store-bought costume. Would you rather get 20 of your favourite treats on Halloween or 50 treats that are not your favourite on Halloween? Do they mean like 50 treats that I don't like? Because then obviously I'd rather have the 20 treats. Um, that's a weird one. I think I'll go for the 20 anyway because they're my favourite treats, so...
Yeah, jelly babies. All of the jelly babies. Would you rather go trick-or-treating with a um, group of friends or get paid $20 to go trick-or-treating with a little kid? I think I'd rather go trick-or-treating with a little kid anyway. Wow, the lighting has changed. Sorry, guys. Um, I think I'd rather go trick-or-treating with a little kid anyway because little kids are fun and they don't egg people's houses. And my friends don't do that anymore, but my friends when I was in school did. Um, yeah. <laughs> Um, yeah, so my battery died, and so I've had to move slightly. I don't know where I got up to. Would you rather um, have to sleep in a coffin or have to live in a giant pumpkin? Completely depends on how long I'd have to live there or how long I'd have to sleep there. If I'd have to live in a giant pumpkin and it's carved out and it would kind of be like James and the Giant Peach, then totally, yeah. If I had to sleep in a coffin, um... Did the lid have to be closed? I wouldn't want the lid to be closed. If it's like James is a giant peach, the pumpkin. If I don't have to close the lid, the coffin. Would you rather have to eat six fish eyeballs or have to eat a small frog? Is the frog dead? Do I know their fish eyeballs? Is the frog cooked? Are the fish eyeballs cooked? If they're cooked in something, then probably the fish eyeballs, if I don't know that they're fish eyeballs. But then they're quite slimy and nasty. Um, frog. I'll go with frog. The French do it. I mean, can't be that bad. Would you rather have to wear a Halloween costume um, every day to school until Thanksgiving, or have to wear a jack-o'-lantern on your head until the, for the first three days of November? Well, seeing as this year my Halloween costume is Wednesday Adams, and um, I'm literally just wearing a dress with a collar and then a wig, then probably Wednesday Adams. Um, can I change my makeup? Because I feel like people wouldn't even notice if I changed my makeup or if I took my hair out of plaits. I mean, I'm wearing a wig, so. And I also don't go to school. And when we go to school in this country, we have school uniforms. Ah, <sighs> America. Would you rather help to design and make a haunted house or go to a haunted house that someone else has made? Um, definitely go to a haunted house that someone else has made because if you've made it then you know where all the scary stuff is and that's not fun. I mean it's fun to make but it's not fun to experience. Would you rather be chased by five zombies or one werewolf? Now I think this is a very complicated question. What kind of zombies? Fast zombies? Slow zombies? If it's one werewolf then is it an old werewolf, a young werewolf? What? Is he a werewolf as a human or a werewolf as a wolf? I feel like the zombies, if they're slow old school zombies, because then you can run away. I mean, if it's a werewolf, they've got like the body of a wolf. They can run down fast. But modern zombies, would I rather be chasing? If it's modern zombies, I think a werewolf. Would you rather trick or treat in the neighborhood or trick or treat at the mall? I didn't know you could trick or treat at the mall. I've never been trick-or-treating. I've only ever gone to Halloween parties since I've been an adult. Um, uh, in the neighbourhood, I guess, because then you know people and you know you're not going to die. Would you rather eat all your Halloween candy or trade your Halloween candy for $10? Who would trade their candy for $10? You'd totally eat it all. All of it. Don't leave a single one. I also work, so I have more than $10 on a regular basis. So. But I don't have sweeties on a regular basis. I should invest in more sweet time. Would you rather dress up as a devil or dress up as an angel? Um, is it a fallen angel or a normal angel? Because it's not very Halloween-y if it's a normal angel. That's more of a Christmas thing. I'd probably rather dress up as a devil um, because then there's loads of different opportunities for things you can wear. You can wear black, you can wear red, you can wear whatever as long as it's satanic. Um, probably a devil. Um, those are all of my would you rathers. Um, you can totally steal this off me and do it as a tag if you want. Um, I recommend all of you do it. Yeah, it's a Halloween soon. <laughs> I hope you're all having a great day. Um, if you like videos, please give it a thumbs up. If you'd like to see more from me, then please subscribe and I will see you in my next video. If you want to have a chat, comment below as always. As always, I will leave my links down below. And yeah, have a great day. Bye.